Hello boys and girls, Andy Raphael from eTechnics.com and today is a massive day. We've done so many videos for today, it's unbelievable. We've reviewed the 7750 reference, 7770 reference, uh, 7750 from HIS, the 7770 from Sapphire. We were due to get many other cards in as well, but they haven't arrived yet. So um, hopefully they will in sort of you know the next couple of days, and we can get to that as well. But what we want to do is show you something a little bit different, and that involves the 7750 reference card and the 7750 uh, from HIS with the eye cooler. Now I'm pretty sure a lot of you can guess what we're actually going to do here with these two cards, but for those who aren't we're going to tell you. So really AMD uh, as well as Nvidia they've both got their fantastic technologies and features and functionality and AMD have got one called AMD Crossfire. If you haven't heard of it where have you been? If you had obviously you know what this is all going to be about. Now with Crossfire generally you'd require a Crossfire bridge and there'd be a little connector up here on the card and you put these into, uh, into your system like so and then bridge them using a crossfire bridge but with these particular cards they don't have uh, a crossfire bridge connector but they can still be crossfired via the motherboard now what we're actually going to do is plug both these cards in they don't require any extra power they don't require any um, crossfire bridge so for a novice user wanting to do things on a budget this is going to be perfect for them because they're going to be able to just literally sort of plug and play so you're going to be able to put both these cards in and as soon as you sort of uh, load into Windows and install your Catalyst driver software, it's just going to give you the facility of we've recognised two cards. Do you want a crossfire? Yes, I do. It will enable it, and then you should be getting uh, better results um, in games. Now we've sort of cheated because we've already done the tests for these, so we know exactly how they perform. And with things like Crossfire as well as Nvidia SLI. Um, it's all down to scaling. So if you're getting 30 frames a second with one card, add another card in, you'd expect 60 frames a second because 30 from each. But it doesn't always work like that because um, the bandwidth is limited. But we found with the 7750s that it's not as limited as most people would think. And that's a good thing because it does allow for extra performance uh, where needed. And obviously on a budget. And that's what this uh, whole video, and um, we will be doing a written uh, aspect of this as well that's what it's all about because we want to show that you can buy two graphics cards like the 7750s that have been released today on a budget and still get performance that can keep up with some of the big boys so um, what we're going to do is get these straight into the system even though we've already done that because like I say we've cheated and done that first um, so what I will actually do is get all the results together and uh, put it on the end of this video so you can see exactly how everything performs um, with the AMD reference uh, HD7750 and the HIS7750 with iCooler in crossfire mode. So uh, be sure to check that out and uh, it's coming up now. 